Hi there, this is Christopher from Themeco. Today we are going to talk about the global blocks. By using a global block, you can add content in one place and use it in the various parts of the website, such as pages, posts, or widgets. You can access the global block screen by going to the Pro or X menu and click the global blocks menu item. The UI of the global block screen is very similar to the content builder and you can add all sorts of layouts and elements. Here you can see a sample layout that I created using the global block tool. To add a global block to a page, you can either use the block element or shortcode. Let's start with the element first. In the content builder, I search for global block element and drag it into the preview. Now I can select the block that I have created before. Let's save and check the result in the front end of the website. And here it is. Another way to add block is to use shortcode. I go back to the global block screen and here you can see the shortcode of the block which I copy to use later. Let's add this block as a widget in the sidebar of the website. Here I add a text widget and paste the global block shortcode and save. Now let's reload the front end of the website and here we added the block into the sidebar. Now comes the fun part. Uh, I can go back to the global block in question and click the pencil icon and change something. For example, I'm going to change the background color of the first row. Let's save and check the result in the front end of the website. As you can see, we changed the block once and it is applied on all instances throughout the website. And here is how we use global blocks in Excel Pro. Thank you all and see you soon.